In this problem, we will talk about the mean and the standard deviation of a binomial random variable. Let x be our random variable, and let it be binomially distributed with parameters n and p. We want to find the mean and the standard deviation of this random variable. The mean of x, or the expected value of x, those mean the same thing, mean and expected value, is equal to n times p. Does that make sense? Yes. The probability of success on one trial is p. If we have n different trials, the expected number of successes in those n trials would just, will just be n times the probability of success. The variance of x, sigma squared x, or variance of x, is equal to n times p times 1 minus p. The number of trials times the probability of success times the probability of failure. Because the standard deviation is just the square root of the variance, we have sigma of x, the standard deviation of x, is equal to the square root of the variance of x. Let's do an example. Let's let our random variable x denote the number of hearts selected from a standard deck of cards when drawing 20 cards from the deck with replacement. In this problem, our random variable x will have a binomial 20 one-fourth distribution. The probability of drawing a heart, there are 13 hearts in the deck, 52 total deck, 52 total cards, gives us 13 over 52 for the probability of drawing a heart. 13 over 52 simplifies to one-fourth. Now, let's find the expected number of hearts that we will select when we draw 20 cards with replacement from the deck. The expected value, or the mean, of our random variable is just equal to n times p, which is 20 times 1 fourth, which is 5. So if we select 20 cards with replacement from a standard deck of cards, we would expect to see, on average, the long run average, we would expect to see 5 of those cards to be hearts. Now let's calculate the standard deviation of the number of cards selected. Before we do that, let's calculate the variance and then just take the square root of the variance to get the standard deviation. We know that the variance of x is equal to n times p times 1 minus p. So that would be 20 times 0 0.25 times 0 0.75, and that turns out to be 3.75. That makes the standard deviation equal to the square root of 3.75, which equals approximately 1.94. And we have that the expected number of hearts selected will be 5, and that will have a standard deviation of almost 2. So using these equations up here, we can calculate the mean of a binomial random variable, the variance of a ran binomial random variable, and then we can get to the standard deviation of the binomial random variable.